So this is the new camera from Drift Innovation. This is the Ghost XL Pro. So it's a step up from the XL. This is the 4K version. It's got the same form factor. We've got the same drift mount clip, the same modular buttons, 300 degree rotatable lens, info display on the back with the Wi-Fi bus symbol. We've got the waterproof microphone connector and we've got the bottom hatch which houses the micro sd card usb c charging point and on the previous xl model there used to be a little hole here you used to put a pin in to reset the camera if ever the camera was unresponsive what drift have done now they've updated the camera so if the camera ever freezes or is unresponsive all you need to do is press and hold the power button which is this first button for 20 seconds and it will reset the camera so we'll have a look at some of the features are connected to the drift life app and we'll have a look through the settings i've tried this camera out already using it on the bike at 4k 30 frames per second so i could check the color range the exposure balance what the audio settings were like now, there's a big improvement on the audio on this camera compared to the XL. The audio is a lot better on there. So it's IPX7 waterproof, the camera. So let's have a look inside the box. So we get USB-C charging cable. We get the microphone adapter to USB. So that way you can charge the camera with it being waterproof and we've got the waterproof microphone adapter so that goes in it's a nice tight seal then so that's all waterproof we get two mounts with it we get a, a flat mount and we also get the curve mount i've already put the curve mount on the helmet and then there we've got the instruction book so we'll have a look at some of the settings on there and we'll have a look at some of the footage. What I'll do is all the settings on here and all the extra features, I'll make those into another video. So this video is just the unboxing and a quick look at the camera. So this is available on the Drift website from the 28th of March. So we've got this as an early bird. We've had a look at it. We were impressed with it. It's 4K, it's got the extra long battery life on there. So I've estimated about four and a half hours I'm getting when recording at 4K. If I have the camera set in 1080, the camera's doing about seven hours recording. So it's got its great battery life, just like the XL. This is just the improved version, improved audio, 4K. It's got the new reset button. It's fantastic. So let's have a look at some of the footage and then we'll have a look at some of the settings in the app. So this is our first test with the new Drift Ghost XL Pro. So I want to check, I wanted to try the camera today because it's bright sky. We've got the bright sun so I wanted to see how the colours worked, how the exposure worked. So let's have a look what the quality is like. Looking at these branches, the blue sky. So four and a half hours of battery life at 4K UHD, 30 frames per second. Okay, so these are the settings. So we'll connect to the ghost. Password is the standard, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. Go to the Drift Life app. Connect to the camera. And let's have a look at the settings. So we've got resolution. So we've got 4K UHD in 24, 25, 30 frames per second. 2.7 in 24, 25, 30, 50, 60. 1080 in 24, 25, 30, 50, 60, 100, 120. 720. The same all the way up to 200, 240, and WVGA 25 and 30. 
camera resolution for taking photos 5, 8, 12 megapixels time lapse settings 12 megapixels 5 second time lapse 10, 1 minute all the way up to an hour photo burst 5, 10, 30 dash cam mode so if you're leaving it in the vehicle running continuously and what it will do the video will loop and record over itself until stopped dash cam interval from 30 seconds up to 10 minutes wi-fi you've got the option of 2.4 or 5 gigahertz field of view 90 115 140 degrees exposure minus 2 to plus 2 self timer from off 3 seconds to 10 seconds bit rate low medium high that's for transferring the data to the card video filter we've got normal vivid low light water ISO setting auto 100 200 400 800 microphone sensitivity off 1 2 3 4 5 video stabilization LED indicator vibrate indication start up resume video photo time lapse burst instant record on video time lapse video time lapse intervals date stamp camera off thumb files so those if you're watching the video back through the drift life app it creates a smaller version of the video so you can watch it back you can change the language restore to default format the memory card and then you've got your serial number and the firmware version so those are the settings in the drift life app for the ghost xl pro so there we go i'll put a link up to the website where you can go and purchase this camera and look at for future videos where i'll go through all the different settings on it